In this video, I'm going to be going over the best dunk animations in NBA 2K25 to help you never get blocked when you go up for a dunk. Every animation that I'm about to go over in this video are very, very safe and have a very low chance of getting blocked. If you're enjoying NBA 2K25 so far, make sure to like and sub because I'm going to be posting daily NBA 2K25 content for the first two weeks of the game. With that being said, let's go ahead and get straight into the dunk animations. So like I said in the intro, all of these dunk animations, they're all very safe. They will not get blocked. Like if you have space to go up for the dunk, you got to make sure that you're not going to get blocked and you're not in danger of getting blocked, if that makes sense. And that's exactly what all of these animations right here do. Now, first off, you want to equip rim grazers off too. You only need a 36 dunk to get that animation. Basic dunks, you don't want to equip anything. For the athletic dunks, you do want to equip athletic one-handers off too. For the hang dunks, you don't want to equip anything. For the quick drop dunks, you do want to equip quick drops off too and quick drop in back scratches off too. These two dunks right here, very safe. That's really what you want in a dunk package once again. Now when it comes to double clutch, you want to equip side clutches off too. When it comes to back scratches, you want to equip quick drop in back scratches off too. Personally, I don't really equip anything for reverse dunks. Now when it comes to tomahawk dunks off too, the only one I would really equip is athletic front tomahawks. And whatever you do, do not equip any of these city dunks, please. Like, you're basically asking to get blocked if you equip any of these. And then when it comes to contact dunks, you want to equip every single one that you can get. For me, I have an 87 dunk so i can only get pro but if you can get a lead and small equip these by any means now when it comes to one foot moving dunks you want to equip rim grazers off one you also want to equip basic one handers off one and basic two handers off one you also want to equip athletic one handers off one when it comes to hangs i didn't go with anything in this area when it comes to double clutch i wouldn't really equip anything here front clutches off one aren't terrible but there are a few in there that might get blocked. If you can get it, I would equip back scratchers off one. When it comes to reverses, I like reverses off one. These two right here. Some of these animations put the ball in danger. And when it comes to the tomahawks off one, you want to go with straight arm tomahawks without a doubt. This animation is probably the best dunk animation in the game. You can get cockback tomahawks too. This one's really good as well. I know it looks like he's exposing the ball, but it never really gets blocked. And that's what I like about that animation. I really equip uber athletic tomahawks. They look really cool, but... I mean, the way you just bring the ball back and bring it low kind of puts the ball in danger again. When it comes to windmills, I don't really like windmills off one. And when it comes to cradle dunks, I would equip cradle dunks off one. Switcheroos, they're not bad, but you can equip switcheroos if you want them. But for me, I don't really like that dunk. Again, city dunks, whatever you do, do not equip these. And then if you can get any of these contact dunks, without a doubt, equip them. And then standing dunks, I honestly would just equip any standing dunks that you can get. Now, when it comes to the signature dunks, there are a lot. So I'm gonna go through this kind of quickly. If you can get them, you want to equip Giannis, Clay Thompson, LeBron James. Zach Levine dunk package is really 50-50. There are some really, really good takeoff dunks in this dunk package. The thing is, there are also some really flashy dunks in this dunk package that can get blocked easily. You also want to equip CJ McCollum, Scottie Pippen. Ben Simmons isn't bad. There are some really good standing dunk animations in this package. And Russell Westbrook is also 50-50. There are some really, really good dunks in here, but there are some that can get blocked easily. So again, really personal preference if you want to risk it. And then when it comes to alley-oops, I... I guess you can go city alley oops if you want to. Now that right there are the best dunk packages in NBA 2K25. With these dunks, you will never get blocked as long as you're going up with a good take. Yeah, that's pretty much it, and I'm gonna catch you on the next video.